Okay guys, we're gonna look at doing a KOT squat, otherwise known as like a sissy squat, which is actually named for Sisyphus, the world's man, or the, the man in Greek legends who had the strongest legs ever. So don't feel like a sissy as you do this. We're gonna be focusing on kind of Michael Jacksoning this whole thing and just leaning forward. I'm gonna be doing uh, five reps, hopefully, as many reps as I can uh, in every minute, on the minute for five minutes. So let's start with the full one. Halfway there. One, two, three, ten seconds, four, five. So for this, what you can do is actually work on even right here, half kneeling and come up just like this with a hip bridge and thrust. Working these for high reps, 13, 14, 15, 20 reps can help build your hip strength to hold you on the actual uh, sissy squats or KOT squats. So this is a regression that most people can start at. Then Halfway there. You guys can go ahead and do to be able to progress on that is then focus on a reverse Nordic, which looks like back on the knees, toes are gonna go backwards, and you're just simply keeping straight legs, going back. 10 seconds. If you can't quite do the sissy squat, I recommend you guys try those butt sits and reverse Nordics first. And if you're in the middle, it's where you can do the sissy squat, but you can't go all the way to the ground. You can do one to an object right here. I'll do five reps. Halfway there. It's kind of like a two-legged Patrick step up to where you're gonna be able to go further, however, than you could with the step ups. So that you can do five to 10 on. But all of these work well to be able to do seconds. Sissy squat. You can really use whichever one you want uh, that's at the right level for you. So just working these every minute on the minute is a great place to start. I believe this might be the last one. We'll go full. There. I'm going to show one more variation called squats and kneeling because I think I have one more round. Ten seconds. When I do these and most variations, I like to have my toes slightly pointed out. Makes mobility Last round. Squat. Now bring your knees to the ground and back. Just practice that transition at the bottom. As you do this, if your feet feel stiff, make sure you're in minimal shoes or no shoes. Halfway there. So those are all the different ways that you can sissy squat, you guys. Run with it, love it, get strong, lower body, done.